Hi everyone, it's Christmas Day 2018 and I decided to stop the time lapse because the flowers are already wilted. I could have kept it going for maybe a couple more weeks, but uh, you wouldn't have seen many more interesting developments. So you can see now that the, um, the flowers are already dry and these ones no longer smell. There's a couple um, white ones that are still left, so for example this guy, um, but they no longer smell. So most of the flowering is over and the foliage is going to stay on for another uh, maybe like six, six weeks, but um, the more the more beautiful part of the life cycle of the bulbs is over. Um, I just wanted to take the opportunity to show you the setup that I had for the time lapse. So basically, I had this um, webcam that I mounted it on a on a tripod, and I hooked it up to my laptop. And um, I use a Linux operating system, and I wrote my own script to con be able to control the shutter speed and all the aspects of the webcam, such as the um, autofocus and the light balance and basically all the settings of the pictures. And then I took the pictures individually um, as snapshots from the webcam and I saved them to individual files and then I pieced them all together to create the final video. So it took me maybe a weekend to write all the software, to write and test all the software involved and um, then I could just deploy it and now I can reuse it for other time lapses as well. So I put the bulbs in the ground maybe in the second half of November and they sprouted around December 1st and um, basically the time lapse covers a period of about three and a half weeks, well basically from December 1st to Christmas. And because the, the flowers are set in a west-facing window, you also get as a bonus to see what the weather was like in Zurich for most of December. Um, and yeah, without further ado, enjoy! <laughs> 